No, it's not Phil Spitalny and his all-girl orchestra. This is String Fever, and it's contagious. Six violins, three violas, three cellos, bass and drums make up String Fever. They're classically trained musicians who've broken through the confines of their structured classical educations and jumped wholeheartedly into swing, blues, jazz, disco, rock, salsa, you name it, they play it. Carrying through the group's philosophy, let's make music and let's have fun. People generally are amazed. They just kind of look, they don't understand. They're hearing something they've never heard before. And it may be reminiscent of, say, nostalgic tunes that they've heard, but this uh, execution of them they've never heard before. And so it's very exciting. It's wonderful to see all different ages. You know, people our age in their 20s and, you know, middle-aged people come. Even my parents come, so it's <laughs> great. <laughs> Members of String Fever also play in the orchestras of the New York City Ballet, New York City Opera, American Symphony, and that just names a few. They admit, though, that the transition from Bach and Beethoven to Basie and Ellington wasn't easy. You read the music and you play it as if you were playing Bach, and, and <laughs> it, doesn't work. it doesn't work at all. And uh, so you have to learn to disregard bar lines and, and just get the rhythm and then swing with it. Still, to go from chamber music to swing? Well, this is chamber music. This is very definitely wonderful American-style chamber music. And to play it is, is uh, mind-expanding and rhythm-expanding and time-expanding and in all ways. You can catch String Fever at McKell's nightclub. It's on Columbus and 97. They play at 10 and 12 every Sunday night, but with the way they sound, every night feels like springtime. Allison Field, News 4, New York. The music of Mozart and Beethoven, Bach, I guess the thing about it that's so wonderful for me is that it moves me, it touches me in my soul. Um, this is music that is ageless, it's timeless. For Marin Alsop, the classics have always been a part of her life. She's been playing the violin since the age of seven, and both her parents are musicians with the New York City Ballet. But Marin decided that she'd like to try her hand at something just a little bit different. So she got an idea to form a string ensemble that can play anything from Bach to rock, and she called it String Fever. There are 14 women in the group, and together they make beautiful music. Playing in an orchestra. A new String Fever. One, two, three, four. between classical music and popular music and music of our parents' generation. Um, just representing fun and love of music. And I think the exposure of classical string players to this kind of music is gonna do everybody a world of good. <laughs> 